Do you know that Nigerians are still leading in many things in South Africa? I mean, like not Nigerians in Nigeria. I'm saying Nigerians in South Africa are still amongst the best. There are still things in South Africa that only Nigerians can do better than any other black person or any other South African. And I'm going to talk about those things to you guys in this particular video. You see, they keep coming on social media and ranting their mouth ranting their mouth one thing is for sure is south africans will never talk about the good things nigerians are doing to them why why so why will south africans never celebrate the good things nigerians have done for them why i've never seen a black south african that will come on social media will come online and say yeah i understand that some nigerians are selling powders to our children i understand that some nigerians are doing these negative things you know at least we nigerians africans and all of us we do at times agree that some nigerians are going to an extent and committing those kind of things that you know south africans are accusing nigerians of we agree at times we at least say okay we have some of our brothers some of our people who have the courage even though we defend them and say they are not the problem because we know where the problem is because you cannot carry maggi and go and sell it in the market of people who don't consume maggi you cannot carry sugar and salt and all of this to go and sell in the market of people who are high blood pressure and you cannot sell product in a market where people don't buy that's why we always defend nigerians we all, i will always defend them every single day because you cannot carry any product to go to a community where people in that community don't need that product if there is no need nobody will carry it and go and sell there but i've never seen a south african that will come on this social media and say oh yes it's true that we have nigerians in this country who are the best entrepreneurs. We have Nigerians in this country who are making sure that there are jobs for some people who are creating jobs, who are creating opportunities, who are opening shops, who are building things. South Africans, why can't you come out online and testify about those Nigerians? Oh, are you telling me that there are no Nigerians in South Africa who are doing great things? Are you telling me? Are there no Nigerians in South Africa who you can be proud to say that, oh my God, these Nigerians are the best in this thing. These Nigerians are the best in this sector. We South Africans, we cannot compare with them at this level. We know for sure. Oh, thank God that Nigerians are here. If not, we South Africans will not be able to have access to this, this and that. Can you not come out and celebrate them like that? Must it be the negative? Now, when the issue of bots came out, that Nigerians are ordering bots, the bots were Allah. You South Africans, you now began to, you, are, you know, some of you now get shame. The shame now made you to start saying, oh, all the board drivers in South Africa are Nigerians and Zimbabweans. So, all the board drivers in South Africa are Nigerians and Zimbabwe. So, are you telling me that all those your jobless South African brothers, they don't want to go and drive boards? So, board refused to employ them. They are looking for, do you know the joblessness rate in South Africa? Unemployment in South Africa is almost the same with unemployment in Nigeria, despite that huge population that Nigeria has. Despite the millions and millions, for South Africa to have the same employment rate with Nigeria is a massive failure on South Africa. You understand? Because you have millions of South Africans, blacks, who are jobless, yet both based in South Africa is busy employing Nigerians and Zimbabweans. Why can't that bot company employ your fellow South Africans? Why? Answer the question. You cannot answer. You will look for another excuse. But you can never go away from me. Because if you run this way, South Africa, I will catch you. South Africa, if you run up, I will catch you. You run down, I will catch you. There's nowhere you can run. I promise you people this, that as long as I'm involved in this matter, South Africa, you will see. Hello? You go up your eyes, see. Yes, there's no running place. There's no hiding place. There are so many things in South Africa that Nigerians do far better than anyone else that even their white masters, we prefer to employ those Nigerians to do those things. But South Africans can never say it. They can never testify it because of envy, jealousy. They keep looking at Nigerians and their mind. They, they, once they see Nigeria, they are looking at Nigeria like that. They are looking at Nigeria. Something they boil for their belly. Something is disturbing. They are, so, they are having stomach problems. They're just looking for the next excuse. That's why they will rather generalize. Even if you have just five Nigerians where they South Africa, where they sell powder. If it's just five, hmm? South Africans will rather generalize those five than celebrate the 100 Nigerians that are opening shops, opening businesses, that are building schools, that are teachers, that are engineers, that are computer develop, web developers. The South Africa will neglect all of those. 
and focus on those small five so that they can use it to cover up their energy towards Nigerians. Shame on you people, shame. My mother used to say, oh, shame, oh, shame, shame. That's how we have to describe it. You people have to wake up. By the time Nigerians caught a South African in Nigeria selling powder, did you see Nigeria carry it on their head? Or you think they have not seen a, a South African in Nigeria selling powder? They don't see them. They have been South Africans seen in Nigeria selling powder. Yes. But let me tell you the truth. You see, in South Africa, when it comes to fashion designing, the best are Nigerians. Your top celebrities in South Africa, your top musicians, they don't wear clothes that South Africans make. They will look for Nigeria fashion designer to make their clothes for them. All South African celebrities, when South Africans have their event, even the Miss Universe or Miss South Africa that you chase Chidima away, you people use Nigeria fashion designers to do your clothes, your dressing, everything. Because Nigerians are simply the best. They are simply great. They are simply good at what they do. But we don't hear that. We know they hear that one. Eh? It sounds like there are no good Nigerians in South Africa. That's the impression they give us on social media. There are no good Nigerians in South Africa. Abi, there are no good ones. Now go humble. You guys will humble. By the time we are done with you South Africans, you will humble yourself and learn how to respect your fellow blacks. You will humble whether you like it or not. It's not just fashion designing. There are Nigerians who are teachers in South Africa and they are the best at what they do. There are Nigerians who are into music production. They who are the best in what they do. There are Nigerians who are into entertainment, movie production, many other sectors in South Africa that are outstanding, that are performing where they are just simply the best. But we don't hear them. We don't hear them being celebrated. They are not celebrated enough. Make one Nigeria just mistakenly get involved in anything negative. Ooh, social media. Social media will carry it. They will carry it like a flag. It will not become the South African flag. You get the point. So South Africans, you have to change in that area and learn how to celebrate these Nigerians who are doing great things in South Africa, who are performing well, who are representing Nigeria well in South Africa. Celebrate them, encourage them, so that more and more Nigerians will be inspired to do good and do great things in South Africa. It is what it is. Your boy, Ajo Magzi, on this one again. Smash the like button, smash the notification bell. Come back anytime you're free, because there's always more, guys. God bless you all. Cheers.